Hey, this is Adam with Heavy Metal Automotive. I'm gonna walk around and show you this 2005 C5500 we have for sale. It's a Duramax diesel with four wheel drive. It's very hard to find truck. You don't see these trucks often at all. As a matter of fact, I've, I've actually never seen, seen a truck like this. So uh, it's got low miles. It's only got 134,000 miles. It's a Southern truck. It has absolutely no rust. It's got a nice set of tires on it. It has a STI utility bed on it with a 8,600 pound crane and a hydraulic air compressor. It has hydraulic outriggers. Inside is very nice. Oh, the whole truck's very nice. Crane controller, outriggers, I'll show all that stuff in a minute. It's got a bath on the back. It's got a nice big rear work bumper, spare tire, there's your compressor, air hose fittings in there. Air hose and reel. This thing had a lube skid in it and they took it out. That's what that was, if you're wondering. That's an extra block there for the winch if you want to double line it. Start it up. No check engine lights, 134 508. Power windows locked. This is a super nice truck. It was a uh, private owned truck. So it didn't see the fate that most uh, service trucks see, which is destruction. Work lights. All right. That one works. That one looks like it doesn't work. All right. To work your crane, flip this switch up, pull your stop switch out, pull that down, try to push that in, there you go, yeah, alright, and then you got, crane up,
I'm just going to show the basic functions on it. Winch down. Tension out, tension back in. Oh, oh that was close. That was close. Let me just bring this dude back around here. Put a winch up. Alright. I'm gonna hook this back on here, so I'm gonna sit the phone down for just a second. Compressor on over here. Switch right here, you turn it on. Push your stop switch in here, turn that down. We'll turn your controller off and your PTO will kick back off. Stick that in. Oh crap, I didn't show the outriggers. Hold on.
All right, if you're looking for a truck like this, give us a call. I may be wrong, but I don't see this truck lasting too long. Uh, if you're looking at this truck out of state, I can get it shipped to you. That's what I would recommend. This is a huge truck, and I don't think anybody wants to be driving it no seven or 800 miles. So uh, that's what I would recommend. You're more than welcome to come drive it if that's what you want to do, but I sure wouldn't do it. This is a huge dude. Uh, you can go on our website, heavymetaltrucks.com, and check out pictures of it on there. Uh, I guess that's about it. Uh, I think that's it. All right, thank you for watching.